Hey everyone, this is Ice Ring Cloud here. Um, yeah, there's not a lot I can talk about now, right now. Um, so you guys might remember this. That's the ramen shop over there. This is. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. I'm a pillar down. Um, this is um the survival server I was talking about. Whew, I need I need to catch my breath. Um, I'm making a base expansion. Um, well, not expansion per se. I'm just making a new base unlike my underwater base i want to make a bigger base so yeah um yeah uh so today i'm just gonna be showing you guys how to make this base one two three four five six seven eight nine ten there you go um i have to take out this iceberg so basically i'm gonna fill you guys in on a lot of the story on the survival server because, um, the owner, uh, the little brother of this uh, server's owner, well, owner as in, well, he, not admin, just the, the guy who makes up the rules, um, he, um, he told me to give you guys a history of everything that's happened here so far, so, um, yeah, I decided to do it, and, um, th this is how it's gonna go out, um, Go down here, place this so I can get back up. I wish I brought my scaffolding. <sighs> Alright. So, first things first. We have, um, over there, far in the distance. I don't have my, I don't have my run distance on. You know what? I need to turn off my shaders. I'm, I'm gonna edit out those shaders. But, um, I need to turn off my shaders because they're gonna lag my, there's gonna, there's gonna be lag. Because there's so many things on the server. And yeah, uh, like oh well, um, alright, so first things first, over there we have the arcade, which is a pretty recent project that we still haven't finished, yeah, there's, there's not a lot I can say about that, it's not much history, it's been blown up by maybe one or two creepers, like, over time, not all at the same time, obviously. Um, there's, yeah, there's not a lot to say about it. There's my, there's Observer Man. I found it on YouTube. It's a, it's a different video. I'll, um, yeah. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And, um, there's, um, the dock. I just added it in the dock because I was annoyed that my base only had one part with a boat. And every time we had to get somewhere through the water, like the drown farm, that doesn't work anymore because the villager in there is dead. Um, every time we had to go somewhere, we had to use, um, well, we had to swim over there. So I decided to add a dock. Uh, some people have stolen some boats. And originally, there were a ton of boats over there. So, yeah. Um, there's, there's not much to say about my ramen shop. It, it just, yeah. There's a lot more things. There's a mob farm somewhere over there in the distance. I might as well just go show you guys, like, right now. Uh, gonna go through here. Oh, wait. that That's, um, that's a siren head that I built. Don't ask why. Just, I just wanted to do it. I had a lot of spare time. So, yeah. Um... Um, you guys can already see, we fought the Ender Dragon, well, I fought the Ender Dragon, I, yeah. We fought the Ender Dragon, we found an Elytra, we got a few Shulker Boxes, I'm gonna put this armor back on now. Um, we have the Ender Egg, and, what, what happened? Um, sorry, it's, the server has a bit of a lag. It, yeah, it happens like that, it glitches a lot. So yeah, you, as you can see, we have the Ender Egg, right around here, why are there so many mobs? We have the ender egg inside there. We have the ender dragon head with a bunch of maps. I, I didn't take didn't take that long to map it out. I used five maps for this. You can only see one, two, three. You can only see four because um, one of them was useless. It was just a copy. We have a gong. Um, yeah. Um, this is from this is again from another YouTube video. The banner is. Just a banner design that I made. So, yeah. Um, 
what else do we have? We have this, an XP farm. It it's broken because, um, don't ask why. It just it's just broken because, um, we don't use it anymore. And um, the person who built this said that it lagged too much. It was actually kind of useful. Uh, we got in it. Over here is what the other people on the server like to call the lobby. I just like to call it the villager part, the villager center. Um, because before th before this ha before this was here, um, we everyone else in the server besides bes the the two oldest people on the server, it's me and um another guy, um, A San Cristo. You might remember him. I mentioned him in a in a, in a past episode. Um, yeah, he um. He, this place used to be our living spot. We had two bunk, we had a bunk bed up here. But now we just went our separate ways. Uh, so we have these villagers here. They'll have different trades. And as you guys can see, I'm using a katana research pack. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna get out here. And, oh yeah, and I forgot to mention, the only enchanting room we have so far is this one. And, um, it doesn't even have, it's not even that good. I need to, I need to eat something. I'm gonna grab this button. Um, we have another portal. Obviously. We all have, we have another portal. Um, I'm gonna show you what it looks like. I made some recent improvements. So, now there's a sort of nether hub. Oh, no. I'm not used to looking at this place. Okay. There's another hub here, and uh, there's a pathway. Uh, we also we also found a Nether fortress. Actually, uh, we found more than one Nether fortress. Just we don't go anywhere there like as often. So yeah, this is the first Nether fortress. This is where I get all my blaze rods from to make all my potions. My potions chest about to fill up. So yeah. Um. Mm hmm yeah um let's just go back home we have a portal to the uh, end just over there um it's all the way over there there's a long way to go to get there but yeah oh, wait hold on Where's it? never mind i'm out Um, behind the, behind the nether portal, we have a, uh, ruined chicken farm. A lot of bamboo, cause, uh, I found some bamboo from the jungle, brought it back, and, uh, yeah, that happened. This place is what, um, this place is what we call the lodge. Doesn't really seem like a lodge to me. Uh, but, there's, there is someone's base down here. And this is a San Cristo's base. I'm not really used to seeing any of this without shaders. So, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna loot to the chest. I'm not taking anything. Um, and from a past, that from a from a really long time ago, we had this, a hidden base that I made inside of a scientist's house. And uh, yeah, there's there's not a lot of history about. Well, there is not a lot of history about the place down here, besides that, he, um, he uh, he was rich enough to find diamond ore and emerald ore, and not mine them just use silk touch and brought them. yeah but um here is his brewing place i don't really have a brewing a, bl a brewing place i usually just i i just put a brewing stand in my house and that's it that's that, yeah all my materials are in there there's a hole in here for some reason and now it's nighttime um, if we go far enough over the horizon, that was just a, a failed attempt at making a house. Um, there's a villager in here, in case you haven't noticed. This guy's still here. Okay, that's good. Uh, okay. Uh, I can't get up there. Um, we have, I have a, I have a history of digging a lot of trenches, such as this one. Someone's clogged up for some reason. Um, more trenches around this place. More and more. Oh god. Ow. Um. Yeah. I'm just gonna run through this. This is the bee farm. And, um, I just fixed it today because one of the bees escaped. Someone forgot to... Uh, I have no idea how redstone works. You know what? Yeah. 
I just fixed a bee farm today because one of the bees has escaped. And then he just, he, he was wandering outside. I, I took a flower and then I brought him back in. And then I, I added a repeater to his circuit because his circuit didn't work out so well. Over here, um, you can see we have a few torches, um, a demolished mushroom house. Don't ask me how that got there. And we have this. It says Gus. Ow. Oh, oh no. Oh no. I gotta run. It says Gus because this is the Gus cave. And, um, we, and, um, well, Ace and Crystal and everyone else go here mining a lot. Blade Spinner, um, there's a lot of people. Why is there a creeper down there? Do I have a bow on me? No, I don't. Okay. I don't even have any arrows. What is wrong with me? Uh, no. Mm-mm. He's dead. There we go. I'm gonna take that, just in case. We have one elytra because uh we're too lazy to find any any others. Wow, this guy's rich. This is Gus this is the Gus Cave bedroom, I guess. It's uh pretty expensive. Uh if we go down here far enough, we have a mob spawner um that we turn into a, a zombie farm that can convert into drowned. Because um, before we play, before we started playing on on uh, Java Edition, we start we played on Bedrock, and when we were playing on Bedrock, um, there was a thing that if you converted a regular zombie into a drown, there was a chance of it spawning with a trident. But uh, since it's a Java Edition, only naturally spawned drown can have tridents in their hands. So. here there we go um i put some glass here just so i can look in there okay you see those zombies they're gonna go in there and uh this is uh where they where they fall in we have a drown conversion switch which converts them all into drown oh there we go converts them all into drown and we have a crusher it just suffocates them there's not a lot i can say about that so yeah um hmm I put some another brick fences because it was because it was hard to find a way back cuz because of how big this um Gus cave is. Oh, technically it's supposed to be a mine. Yeah. Um yeah. Um You know what? This is going to take a long time to get back, so uh, I'll cut this out. Guys, in case you're wondering why I have unenchanted weapons, is because I died a lot in the past, um, in lava, in the void, because of the end, you know. I died a lot. Oh yeah, and I did this as well. I died a lot, and I, I died a lot in the past. Um, I lost a lot of stuff. Uh, my silk touch pickaxe and my fortune pickaxe. I really, really liked um silk touch because it could get me stone bricks. Which was a block, which was a block that um, I really, really love. Besides smooth stone, those two are my favorite blocks because they look so much like bricks. Anyways, uh, that's enough of me rambling. Um, I need to get back home. We have a stable, another trench, that abomination with a even bigger abomination hat. Yeah. Um. So we have a tree house up here with a giant square cube for some reason. It's just there. No reason at all. Just it just is. So yeah, you can jump all the way down. This is this technically leads to the Gus Cave all the way over there. So that's how far it actually spreads. You can, you can get a visual get a you can get a visual thing. You you can see how far it spreads. It can connect all the way to the Gus Cave. There used to be a modern house over here, but, uh, no, nah, it's gone. It, um, it got torn apart. I took away the concrete. I made this 
I was because I usually build all the aesthetics and stuff. Since no one's gonna, since no one likes, since no one's gonna come here, I'm just gonna take that bell. There we go. Um, yeah. Oh come on. Like that? Oh my god. Why is this one so strong? Why is he so strong? There we go. So, uh, yeah. We have a storage room that, uh, didn't, didn't, uh, have a good one. There's just a lot of, there's just a, a lot of useless items in there. Because we don't use that anymore. We all have our own storage spaces. Such as my, um, barrel room, if you guys don't know. Um, what? We have a chorus farm. Um, it's, yeah. We have a chorus seed farm. We don't really use it for anything else. Because there is no other thing it's useful for. It's just good at getting us chorus flowers and that's it. Oh no. This is Observer Man. You might have seen from a Reddit post. Something like that. You know. I just I just found that on YouTube watching a few videos, so yeah. Um this uh, this is an item sorter that someone broke. Don't don't uh, don't I don't know who just someone broke it. And uh yeah. Now um you can see over there there's Siren Head. If we go far enough beyond the horizon, we have an well a sort of desert outpost, which is like a house. In the desert, I have two trader llamas over here. Um, three cats. I only named one of them because I'm not rich. I don't have that many name tags. Grab this bell. Put this on here. Where am I supposed to put this? Hmm. Go up here. Maybe up here? Nah. This isn't symmetrical. What about in here? This is the storage room I was talking to you about. The floor is made out of barrels. So this is this is very smart because everything I need is right here. These are all the bottles I need. Um books, spectral arrows, a lot of things over here. Stone sword, a lot of there's just usually just junk in here. That up there. There's a lectern. Just wanted to place one. Um I have two ways to go down to my mines. This is the second way. The first way is over there through the magma elevator. Jump down here, and this is a slime farm. Hold on, that's because I have two. Because that's because I live near two slime chunks. I don't know how how I got that lucky. I just am. Oh wait, hold on. I know where to go. So I improvised a slime farm, and uh, this happened. It actually it actually works kind of well when you're around. I have two AFK pools. One of them is just above this platform. Why am I getting so many slimes? I don't need that. Um, there are two AFK. There are two AFK pools. One of them is up here. Just, just a swirl, a swirl, so that every time it move, every time you go in here, it's gonna move around. Um, yeah. There was another one right above. No, not above. Over here, I have another one from right through here. There we go. There's another AFK pool. Because I AFK a lot in Minecraft. Well, at least on the server. I don't AFK that much in single player. I have a grindstone. I have an AFK fish farm. Just so I can get um, some sort of unimportant enchanted stuff. So I can use this to grind it off. Because you you can get experience back for it. Not, not uh, enough. Just experience. Um, what else do I not need? I don't need this. I definitely do not need these. Where am I supposed to put this? I'm an end pearl chest. Yeah, okay. Um, so, uh, yeah. Let me know if you guys want to extend this to make this a better series. Like, besides just all of this. Just... Besides just this one episode, because, you know, I really enjoy playing on the server. 
I mean, there might have been a lot of tough times. Like, um... Mm, yeah. You know what? I'd rather not talk about it. There were a lot of things that, um, happened here. And, um, I just, I just wish we could make more videos about it. So, yeah. Um, uh, tell me in the comments if you guys want more of these types of videos on this server. Uh, yeah. One, two, three. So, uh, bye. Hey everyone, I'm sorry I, re I didn't record for a while. Um, I promise this is gonna be a last time I'm gonna be using resource packs. But, uh, the shaders are gonna stay. Um, besides, um, this video was an, was an idea that, um, Ace and Crystal's brother gave to me. Uh, also known as Blade Spinner. You might have seen him online. Yeah, this video is for them. So, um, yeah. Bye.